Now, the Wabash Valley's most watched newscast continues with Storm Team 10 meteorologist Lindsay Monroe. Good morning, everyone. A very cold start to the day and temperatures only going to fall from here. We're at 39 degrees with a cloudy sky. Those winds coming in out of the west northwest. They're going to continue out of that direction for today, which will really usher in those cooler temperatures. We're going to stick with the cloud cover that's out there. We can also see Maybe a few flurries filtering in as we head through later this afternoon and into this evening. That's going to be some precipitation left over from the center flow pressure that moved through yesterday afternoon. Now let's talk about those falling temperatures out there across the board. We're starting off at 32 degrees in Mattoon. It's 32 in Casey as well. 39 in Terre Haute, a little bit warmer down to our southeast. 40 in Linton. It's 41 degrees right now in Vincennes. But I do want to zoom out and give you a look at the bigger picture and that's going to show you where that pool of cold air is. We're in the teens across northern portions of Missouri across Iowa, 19 degrees right now in Des Moines. But look back at Omaha, single digit temperatures, and that's not a wind chill. That's the actual air temperature, just nine degrees. This cold air off to our northwest will slowly work its way in back behind that cold front heading through the day today and temperatures. We've already hit the warmest for the day, only going to fall from here. Now here's the leftover rain that moved through during the evening last night. I look up to our north and that's where the center of low pressure is. We could get some rain eventually changing over to some flurries as we head through the day. We'll look at those chances on future cast. Now we'll keep the clouds with us during the day. This is at 8 o'clock this morning. The cloud cover sticking with us, so look for that cloud cover to be with us heading through the day. And then the flurry is eventually working their way in after 6 p.m. Temperatures today in the mid 30s, so 39 degrees. We've already hit 41 a few hours ago, so that was the warmest. We are going to continue to trend downward from here. So at 8 a.m., it will be an overcast start. Those cloudy skies sticking with us, even though the sun's coming up at 759. Not going to see much sun at all today. Heading to the 1 o'clock hour, it will be a little bit colder. Temperatures pretty steady in the mid 30s. We're talking 36 degrees by 1, dropping back to 35 at 6 p.m. And even at that point, that's when we're going to start to see that chance for some flurries to work their way back into the valley. We'll time all this out on future casts now. This is at 8 o'clock tonight. You can see the uh, leftover precipitation slowly working its way southward. It's going to be very light and very scattered. So as far as accumulations, not looking at anything like that, but a few flurries are not out of the question. They'll come to an end before midnight. Eventually, your sky is becoming partly cloudy to start us off for Tuesday morning. This is at 7 a.m. It will be a cold start all the way back into the mid 20s during the overnight tonight and temperatures going to stay pretty cool for tomorrow. We'll struggle to get into the upper 30s, but the good news is Cloud cover finally breaking apart. We'll get into some mostly sunny skies, high pressure and control for us. We'll see some sunshine lasting all the way through at least midweek as that high pressure does stay in control. Now by 7 a.m. on Wednesday, once again looking for a cold overnight with clear skies dropping back into the lower 20s. Those high temperatures staying pretty seasonal as we head through midweek as well. Today's high 37. As I mentioned, we're at 39 now. We were in the lower 40s a few hours ago, but those temperatures going to fall as we head throughout the day. We'll stay pretty steady in the mid to upper 30s with the chance for some light afternoon flurries working their way in. Otherwise, we'll do cloudy skies during the day today. A few flurries still possible, mainly before midnight tonight. They'll taper off. Skies will become partly cloudy as we drop back to 24. Eventually clearing that sky out completely by tomorrow. We're looking for mostly sunny skies. Temperatures still rather cool, only near 38 degrees. We should be near 43 for that average daytime high. Looking ahead for the next uh, few days, though, by Wednesday, temperatures warming up near 44. We see that sunshine sticking with us through midweek. Eventually, more cloud cover for another system works its way in by this weekend. Temperatures staying pretty steady, at least above freezing, so any chance of snowfall that's going to be today and then not again until next Monday. So a little bit more seasonal this week. A few flurries, but not too much yet. No, not that widespread accumulating snow a lot of people have been asking about. Not quite yet. Not quite yet. All right. Thank you, Lindsay.